And now from lovely Three Forks, Montana, Todd the Vinyl Junkie, with a face for radio and a voice for silent movies. Now your host, the Vinyl Junkie himself, Todd. Hello everybody and welcome again to the TTVJ Audio YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about a new product, the Quadratic MC1 Step-Up Transformer. Quadratic Audio is headed up by the very likable and excellent design engineer Jam Samasundram. Jam was the creator of the PassLab's HPA1 headphone amp that was well liked and acclaimed as an excellent headphone amplifier. This is actually how I came to know and befriend Jam was through my relationship with Pass Labs. One day I got a call from Jam saying he was starting his own company and would I be interested in selling his upcoming step-up transformer. I replied, of course I would. After a bit of a wait I received an MC1 step-up transformer from Jam's new company Quadratic Audio and after listening to it we became the first company to carry the Quadratic MC1. It's always good to be first in line. MC cartridges have a, have a small 0.2 to 0.5 millivolt outputs as opposed to the 4 to 8 millivolt from a typical MM cartridge. Additional amplification is required and that amplification needs to have quite a bit of gain while adding little to no noise into the signal path. This can be done using a step-up transformer. One that is well designed serves its user very well. Being a vinyl junkie and curious to see what this new product could do with my bevy of MC cartridges, I inserted it into my big rig first to give it a listen. Using the MM section of my Esoteric EO2 with the MC1 step-up transformer proved to be an interesting test. The first thing I noticed was that the MC1 was very quiet. It was pitch black. It was like it wasn't even there. The music was a tad bit less dynamic, or maybe better put, more relaxed, but with excellent detail and imaging. Using the Lyra Aetna, the softer sound offered a more romantic but fully satisfying experience. Bass was very good and solid, mids smooth, and highs detailed and non-fatiguing. There was no apparent coloration introduced by the MC1, just a softer presentation. The characteristics of the Aetna came through without the MC1 adding color to the sound. The MC1 lets the cartridge's characteristics shine through no matter what cartridge I used. For testing, we used the Lyra Cleos and Aetna, a Shelter 501 Mark III, Ortofon Cadenza Bronze, Ortofon Quintet Black, and a Koetsu Rosewood, and all played very well with the MC1. With the frequency response of 10 Hz to 100 kHz, the MC1 covers all audible frequencies and much more. I had no problems with outside interference with the MC1, no hum or unwanted noises. It has a nice case and front panel to isolate the internals from most problems, though I suppose if placed on a power amp or other component noise could be generated. I didn't test this out as I have room to keep it away from noise generating pieces. The MC1 has two convenient gain settings, high at 28 dB and low at 22 dB. When hooking up the MC1, you of course plug it into your MM section of your phono stage with the impedance setting at 47 K ohms. Internal cartridge matching settings on the MC1 are 70 and 200 ohms. The MC1 is a dual mono design utilizing dual ground planes for best stereo separation. Custom Cinemag transformers are at the heart of the MC1 delivering excellent performance. Cinemag has 60 years of experience making transformers for audio gear. The transformers used in the MC1 are exclusively built for quadratic and not available to the public. RCA inputs and outputs on the rear panel make connecting the MC1 into the signal path a no-brainer. Only two pair of interconnect cables, one for the input and one for the output, are required to hook the MC up between your turntable and the MM phono section. Um, on the rear panel there is also a ground for your phono section. No power cable is required as the transformers do all the work themselves creating the needed gain for your MC cartridge. The MC1 measures in at six and a half inches across as you can see here it is eight inches deep and three inches tall and we'll go all the way around once just so you can see the whole thing it weighs a whopping 4.2 pounds elegantly designed and uncompromising in its design and implementation the quadratic mc1 will serve anyone who is looking for a very good step up transformer for reasonable money the sound is excellent imaging very good 
It is quiet and very easy to use. It is everything you need for your MC cartridge listening experience when paired with a good MM Phono stage. Two thumbs up for the MC1. Now we look forward to other products to come from Quadratic in the near future, so stay tuned to TTVJ Audio for new product news from Quadratic. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to visit the TTVJ Audio website and sign up for our newsletter. Keep up to date with new products, sales, and loaner programs. Thanks for watching.